Welcome back YouTube, this is Dragonail2031 here, and now we're going to finally finish up the night levels. Well, at least for now, anyways. So now this is a conveyor belt level we have to deal with. So pretty much they'll just give us the um, plants when they want to. Hang on. Alright, sorry about that. Um, my cat needed something. Okay, so in this one, you want to save up your doom shroom and ice shrooms, because um, you never know exactly when you're going to need them. So, so right now, I may need an ice shroom. And like, the after effect is that, well... Okay, I'm not really getting many offensive plants here. I'm going to have to use it. They actually give you a lot of grave busters in this thing. I almost got all these graves gone, so say. So there's not really a strategy you can do with these levels, like I said before. Sorry if I'm sounding very repetitive. I'm getting plenty of doom shrooms here. Now, ah, great, just great, just great, just great. No hypno shroom. Of course, the one time I don't put a fume shroom in the right place. Oh boy, here we go again. I wonder if that would count as cannibalism. You know, a zombie eating another zombie. Does that count as cannibalism or what? But then again, they're already dead, so probably not. Okay, I'm getting a lot of grave busters. And I'm actually running out of room because of all these doom rooms I have. So, you know what? I'm going to use one. That, that football zombie just ate the other football zombie. I mean, I had to take him out right there. I mean, you know, I got the plants to spare. Right again. Now, if you're wondering why I'm putting my puff, puff shrooms so far back, it's because like okay, they have a short range, so like I'm not really sure if they'd be too useful, or well, you know, too helpful. Ah, great again. Wow, perfect timing. Send him back. Yeah, 
I'm not even gonna try to, you know, freeze frame it. Well, no, it's second thought. Hey, well, you know that, um, crater that I left is almost, uh, fully returned to normal Earth, so say. Now, surprisingly, when you're playing with the um, when you're playing on the pool levels and you have a doom shroom and you put out a lily pad, you can't plant a lily pad on wherever the spot you just use a doom shroom on either. Leaves this really messed up. I don't even know how to describe it. Like, I guess we'll call it the charred remains of a lily pad. Am I one? Am I missing one guy? There we go. Yeah, look at that. See, look at all the craters I put in this thing. Oh, well, you know, it's a nice room. Alright, and that is finally the end of the ice level. And I got a penny pincher achievement. That you plant not quite plants on top of it. Okay, now the penny pincher, you pretty much gotta just grab 30 coins in a row or something like that. Or like play through a level where you grab every coin. Looks like the zombies gave up attacking your front yard. Now they're trying your backyard. And on top of and to top it all off, you can't even use your mushrooms. Yeah, the mushrooms you can only use at night. Cause they'll fall asleep during the day. I just said that. Well isn't that just dandy? Okay, sorry about that. Uh, my mom needed something. Anyways, the lily pad lets you plant not quite plants on top of it. Basically saying so. It's kind of like, um... Well, I can't really explain, I can't really say what it can be compared to. But like, um, these pool levels introduce two new types of zombies that are pretty difficult to deal with. So pretty much what you want to start with in this case, you just basically, so you know, basically, you know, you just use your pea shooters, your sunflower, you can maybe use a walnut and potato mine if you want to. Now, these pool levels, um, they will in fact get more difficult. Oops. And plus, you gotta watch out for zombies that'll go in your pool. I don't know why they wanna go in your pool. I mean, like... Really. Well, this level will be pretty fast, so I should be able to get through it. Without having to, um... You know, cut the video short, like, mid-level. Now, for those lily pads, they don't fight at all. They just give you a space enough you to put your plants. On some levels, this is actually quite handy. On other levels, it's a bad thing. Well, it's a good and bad thing. It's kind of like a mix of both. Now, I more than likely won't be able to save enough sun to get either Snoopy or Repeater. But, you know, I just put it there. I guess it's sort of like a space saver. Or a um, space user. And again, I am looking at the clock, okay, and it is at 9.18. By clock, I mean by, you know, the recording time. It's actually just 5.53. Alright, so pretty much what you gotta do first, make sure you have all of your, um, rows covered. Before then, you can start getting, um, so I say complicated. Like, you can actually start saving up your sun, even though the level's not that long, so I doubt if you're gonna really be able to, um, you know, get any high park plants in there. And here comes our first aquatic zombie. This thing is called a ducky tube zombie. Why? Because he has a ducky tube. And kind of speaks for himself.
Yeah, they will. There are three variations in when it comes to ducky tubes. Okay, there is the normal, as you can see right here, the cone head, and there's one more called the bucket head. Okay, it's pretty much like you took the first three zombies you encounter in the game and just put it and just made them floatable. Think about it like that. So I mean, this level's pretty much beaten. Yeah, more than likely I'm not able to use a repeater. I just couldn't think of anything else to use. Yeah, the zombies do come up from underneath your pool. As well. Hey, wait, oh wow, I actually do get to use it. Well, you know. Okay, I'm hitting the 11 minute mark. I'm gonna end the video after I beat this level. And show you what plant it we get. Come on! Die. So then what do I call this? Well, not really a strategy. I mean, it's pretty much the first strategy you use in the game. So, you know. And we get a squash. Squashes zombies. Straight and simple to the point. Alright, well, I'm gonna cut this video. Okay, I mean, we got through two levels. We probably get average about two levels per video because what was screencast o matic give you only 15 minutes for recording time on the free version, so, yeah. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time.